Welcome to the Hot Mic SE. Former South African President Jacob Zuma wants to be president again so he can fix things. The former president for nine wasted years, according to the current president, says he wants to come back to fix things. Former President Jacob Zuma, now the face of the MK party, paid a visit to the Nazareth Baptist Church, Holy Mount Kenani, on Saturday. He was accompanied by MK party president Jabulani Kumalo to worship with the Shembe congregants in Dwedwe, north of Durban. Former President Jacob Zuma has given the clearest indications yet that he will likely be the MK party's presidential candidate. Zuma, who was president for almost two terms, told the Nazareth Baptist Church, Shembe, on Saturday that he wanted to come back to fix things. All of you know I was removed before my presidency term ended, before I was done being a president. I was removed because I was trying to solve problems experienced by the poor. The manner in which the current ANC government have behaved has motivated me to want to come back because I want to fix things, he said. Zuma highlighted load shedding as one of the issues the government has failed to fix, pledging that a government led by him via the MK party would make it its key focus. However, load shedding predates the current administration. While relaying his impatience with the ANC regarding load shedding, Zuma, who lives in a palatial homestead fitted with generators, likened himself to poor South Africans who cannot afford alternative energy sources. In recent time, the majority of us with no external sources for electricity have been affected. It has been incredibly hard, he claimed. He asked the congregants guarded at the Kenana holy site for their prayers. We are asking for prayers from the believers, us who are in politics, that all goes well this year. I am here to ask for your prayers that we govern the country well, that there are no complaints against those in government, said Zuma. The revelation comes as the party, through a public statement, announced a gag order against its president, Jabulani Kumalu. The MK party suggested that Kumalu had not earned the right to speak because he himself has not been appointed as president by any congress whatsoever, adding that he had no part in growing the membership of the party. South Africans who have been hoping for a change after Cyril Ramaphosa's reign for years without any change hope that if the MK party wins, Jacob Zuma will go by his promises. Thank you all for watching and please don't forget to kindly drop your comments, drop a like and please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. Thank you.